Good morning, Slayers. Okay, so I finally bit the bullet. But before we get into this, welcome back to my channel. And if you are new, welcome to the family. Um, welcome to Finance Fridays on Saturday. I know I'm late, but life has been happening, y'all. And so the unboxing of my new cash envelope wallet is happening on Saturday. No cash stuffing today. I don't get paid until next week, Friday. So the cash stuffing will be happening next week. This week for Finance Friday on a Saturday, we are doing my cash envelope wallet unboxing. I got this from Amazon and I believe it was about $25. Um, I'll try to link it in the description box below. Um, but the brand is so I've heard people say so legit, but I don't, I don't know. I don't think so. But we're just gonna go with so legit. <laughs> uh, cash envelope wallet, the stylish wallet that can make, that can help make budgeting fun. So it came in this little box. Um, we're going to open it together. I got my candle, my tea, my pen. We're all ready to go. So let's see what this thing has to offer. We'd love to hear your thoughts or see pictures. So basically just like leave a review and we hope you're happy. It's a cute little thank you card. All right. So then, should we go to the wallet first or to the envelope? Should we take a look at the envelope? I kind of want to look at the envelope. So we're going to start with these. They come in wrapped in plastic with things so I can un there we go. Okay, so you get budget sheets that are also hole punched, so you can add them into your wallet, which I like. Part of me kind of wants to get these um, laminated, even though. Okay, so let me explain why I got this cash envelope wallet. Because I went to the store the other day and I took like the whole big binder with all my cash envelopes with me because I needed to pick up stuff. And it was just such a hassle to have to dig through the envelope to keep finding the envelopes that I needed to take money out of. So I was like, I just need to get a wallet for the envelopes where I do spend the cash. So like my everyday categories and um, like miscellaneous, like those kinds of things. I feel like I should just be able to carry them in my purse and it made more sense to have them in a wallet than just like free floating around in my purse. So that brings us back to why I got this envelope. So if we're doing, because we're doing like my everyday category and things where the money is gonna be taken out, I don't know if I'm gonna need these budget sheets for this binder. Maybe for a different binder, like once I get my life together and fully commit to buying like, um, cash envelope binders for all of my thinking funds and everything. These will make more sense since the money in those other envelopes doesn't really move and I don't spend it. So for the time being, these will not be being used. So we're just going to set them to the side. They're cute though. Like, they're real cute. But I just won't be using them for this wallet. So we'll set these to the side as well. All right, but back to the envelopes. And I'm so glad, like, gold is my favorite color. So I was looking for envelopes that had some gold in them. And these are like black and white and gold. So it didn't make me not have a minor cute. So this one is a white and gold pattern. Really cute. Black and 
gold one with a white background. carry around with me in my purse so that way I don't have to bring out the whole entire binder so before we start writing on these let's look at the binder itself so it came in plastic and then wrapped in tissue paper Um, it has like a really nice texture feel to it. I don't know if y'all can see the texture, but like it doesn't feel like leather. It doesn't even feel like leather. I don't know <laughs> what the texture is, but like it, it feels nice. Um, so it has this little front pocket. I can just see myself throwing change in there. So I'm like gonna be used for. And it's nice gold zipper. I'm so excited, so let's get into labeling these envelopes. All right, so first we have gas. Well, this pen right on these laminated envelopes. Only time to tell. Oh. 
actually have, yeah, I'm right-handed, so it makes more sense for them to lay this way. through envelopes while I'm trying to buy stuff like it was so it was a lot <laughs> like it was way more hassle than it needs to be so that'll just be strictly for holding like my long-term cash envelopes where I'm not touching the money only to take it to the bank but as for like money that I need to take out and have on hand to spend this wallet fits so much better so this is my old wallet don't judge it like it's all chipped up and it's cracking and stuff I've had this wallet for years like literally years it has been through many purses and it shows <laughs> this is my wallet um here's the size comparison so as you can see 
the so legit wallet is a bit longer and currently since it's empty like it is a bit thinner than my old wallet but it'll still fit nicely in my purse this wallet has seen better days so first look for it envelope see if there's any money we need to transfer over um miscellaneous has ten dollars in it so we will take that money and put it in its new home started with my business where I was out in the store and I was like picking up some stuff for a uh, craft show that I was about to do to like sell my soaps or whatever and one of the women who was in the store started talking and I was telling her like what I was in the store for and she asked me if I had a business card and I didn't and it was like it was so embarrassing but then at the same time like I had just started and the business cards hadn't come in the mail yet so now I keep some in my wallet at all times to pass out to people because you know 
you gotta advertise yourself. So in this front pocket here, um, I put all of my debit cards as well as my coupon card for the thrift shop on post. I sure do. Um, gives me 20% off. And then down here, I carry around like all my important papers, copy of my social and birth certificate. I don't know why. I carry it around in my other wallet for why I'm gonna carry it around in this one. I just feel like I always need it and I never have it on me when I do need it in those circumstances. So I think that's why I started carrying it on me. But it's just a copy, not the original. So on this other side, these are all my credit cards and like gift cards and membership cards like Sam's Club. This is a Macy's gift card I had got a while, like a long, long, long time ago and I never used it. I have to check it to see if the money that's on it is even still good. Um, and then credit cards are over here. And this is for a salon that I used to go to. They, I loved that did my hair. So if ever I'm back in Jersey, at least I'll have the phone number where I can stop through and get my hair done. So yeah, we have transferred everything over. New wallet is all done. Like, is she real cute? She is super cute. I don't know what I'm gonna do with this front pocket. Like, it's not that deep and can't really like open it much. So I don't know what I'm gonna do with that. So I'm gonna stop pulling on it, putting the crease in it. Yeah, this is my new wallet. I'm so happy that I finally got one. It'll probably gonna make life so much easier than carrying around this big old thing. And then I just had like a whole bunch of other papers and just randomness that I was carrying, like membership cards, AutoZone, AC more. I don't even think they exist anymore. Library cards, like just a lot of foolishness and randomness. Copy cards, but I think staples. Um an expired AAA card, another, I think this was like a gift card from AutoZone, I have to check to see if money is left on that. It probably won't be much, but like enough to get me some air freshener. Um, and then this is another gift card, I have to call about that one. This was just some random net spend card that just randomly came to me in the mail. I never asked for it or requested it, and anyway, it's expired, so trash. Laundromat card, I remember the days. And then a Bobby's Burger child is like, listen, just random. Just real random. So, all these expired and unnecessary paper things go in the trash. I have to call about these two gift cards. And yeah, my wallet is now complete. I know people like name their wallets and everything, but I, I'm not that into it. Like, this is just a wallet for me. This <laughs> is my wallet. Um, like, El Muradero. Surprised I remember that word. But yeah, my new cash wallet, I'm so excited. Let me go put her in my purse before I forget her. But all right, thank you guys so much for joining me in this new cash envelope wallet and stuffing. I hope you guys have a great day. And remember, all 2021 and beyond, we are slaying our own dragons, solving our own problems, and making things happen for ourselves. And I'll see you guys in the next one.